Today, today we're scratch printing a train station on the iron horse route. Stick around. Hey, this is Brian with the Iron Horse Free with home of the Denver and Rio Grande Western, welcoming you to the channel in part four of my Denver Union Station project series. We're glad you are here. We did building three in part one. We did building four in part two live. We did building two in part three, and now we're doing building one in part four. Building one's a very simple building. It's only got five pieces, except for it's got 80 accessory parts. A highly detailed building. This is going to be a fun building. We're glad you're here. This is Brian with the Iron Horse Group. I'm with the Denver Rio Grand Western, welcoming you again to the channel. If you're not a subscriber, I want to encourage you to subscribe. Click the bell icon and share this with your other modeling crews. Again, this is a simple model with only five pieces, but highly detailed with 80 accessory pieces. We're going to bring you over here to the bigger table, put you in time lapse, show me assembling the model. It's going to be some fun, y'all. Yeah. And since we pulled the diorama, I want to take an opportunity to show you the back of the model. I haven't been able to do that yet. Actually got one of the platform pieces for the back printing back here. What you got here is you got stairs coming up. You're gonna have a piece here and on the other side as well. Your tracks will lay down in here. Okay. You got stairs here, stairs here. You're gonna have a covered seating area on this on this level here, here, and here as well. So we'll have uh, loading platform, loading platform, covered seating, covered seating, covered seating, two dummy tracks, one going one way, one going the other. Then we're going to come back here and we're going to have a road. Okay. We'll have a road here and a road coming this way. What I plan to do is I'll have two fronted city buildings back here, one of which is going to be in Italian. All right, so before I put you in the time lapse warp, I want to show you the pieces. Let's see, we'll wait. Let's say that again in a minute. Here. 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 All right, before we put you in the time lapse warp, I wanted to show you the pieces. Okay, so you've got insert, roof, and what I did is I cut a, I didn't put my roof insert gap. I printed this too early, wasn't thinking about that, but it'll be fine. I did put a hole here and here, and so the light from the bottom, I'm hoping will come up through into these holes and show some light up here. We'll see. I did leave it hollow, so it would try. Okay. Um, obviously, this is one side. This is the other side. This is the exterior piece and the interior piece. Each of these pieces has an insert like so. I don't know if this is the exact one that fits there. I'll have to check more closely. Um, they have an accent like this. Each has a frame like this. Each has a accent like this, a frame like this, and a door like this. All right. So we will be accenting this building with all these accessories. And so I'll be putting um, all the accessories on and then I'll assemble the model. So for now we're going into time lapse and we're going to be working on all the accessories. I'm going to be using the Fowler thinner glue for the smaller accessories and I'll be using the old trusty red glue that's got more teeth for the main wall. We want 
time lapse now. So now we are down to one, two, three, four, five, six pieces. Let's assemble them and get this next to the model and see how it looks. Come back into time lapse. Alright everybody, here we have buildings one, two, three, and four. We just have to do five, which is a mirror image. And then we will be back here working on the back area. Alright, we'll have two dummy tracks back there. And we will have, a, a, we got a couple platforms. We'll have some seats, covered seating on this area right here. If you see, I got some pilot holes drilled right there we will we'll fill in here and here and then back here we're gonna have a road going this way and it will intersect here I'll have a building here a building here one of those is gonna be an Italian restaurant over here we will have parking okay there's a sidewalk that it has here and then we'll have parking right here and the same goes right here we'll also have clocks here 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 and here and then there's an orange neon sign that says union station that'll be here and on the other side as well we also have to complete this the overhang it is not complete at all it will come around here and down into here and actually over to just above this door so we are got to get those glued in and then these glued in here and then we're going to come in and try to match that paint on all of them also we're going to be putting some supports in here that will connect 
this overhang to the wall um, just little um, tiny supports that's actually um, there on, in real life and I think it'll look good on the model as well so we will have sidewalk parking parking um, raised platforms with two tracks road city buildings back there and all that goes over here i'll have that there in just a second and then we'll say goodbye all right everybody this is brian with the iron horse route home of the denver and rio grand western and aj and i want to thank you for visiting the channel and watching us build building one this is the building for building one. This is the fourth build in our series. We have a playlist. It'll be there will be a card on the end screen for the playlist. If you have not seen the other episodes, you can refer back to them and watch the others. We still have to do building five, like I said before, and many other things to the back area. But we are moving, and this was everybody, this was building one today. Today we built building one right here, and it was a fun build, everybody. About an 86-piece building, um, 80 of them were accessories, and uh, we had a good time. I'm happy with it, and again, there's weathering to do and all that kind of stuff, touch up and weathering and everything else, but the structure is down, it's there, and uh, we'll be able to remove the diorama and add the weather and those kind of things later. Thank you for joining us today. If you have not already, we wanna encourage you to subscribe. Please click the bell icon, share this with your other modeling friends, and most importantly, please leave us a comment below so we know that you are here. Smash the thumbs up button, please. And again, the most important thing, please leave us a comment below so we know you are here. Thank you very much.